The city of Evansville is asking residents to speak up about housing discrimination through a fair housing survey. It's all part of a federally mandated assessment that will help shape the city's future housing policies. Boyd from supporter Courtney Green has more on how you can get involved. The city of Evansville wants to know, have you faced housing discrimination? They're giving residents the chance to anonymously share their experiences through a fair housing survey. Official Colby Jackson says this survey is required for the city to run every five years to receive federal funding. Every five years as part of the consolidated plan, um, we have to do a fair housing assessment piece and so solicit a consultant to um, administer and kind of oversee that process for us and then we have them put together a survey that will go out to the community and we go from there. The feedback will help shape the 2025 Fair Housing Assessment and the Consolidated Plan, documents that the city submits to HUD to secure funding for housing initiatives. We have our communications director push that on social media platforms, on the City of Evansville website. We have posted it throughout the building and we have a QR code that is um, able to be scanned on your phone. We have business cards that have the QR code on it so that it can be like passed around. We have multiple ways that we can get the word out for the survey. Jackson explains the multiple ways the city is reaching out to the community. A lot of uh, residents are tenants and so they're renting and they're spending way more on their um, rent and then they bring in their income. And so that is one of the things that we hope to help alleviate, you know, over the next five years. Housing affordability remains one of the biggest challenges for Evansville residents. Many renters spent more on rent than they bring in. And Jackson hopes that this survey results will help guide solutions to this problem. But when we receive that feedback from those in the community, that will help us realize, you know, what are some possible solutions that we can um, implement that might help alleviate that particular barrier. While the city has yet to fully identify all the barriers. Jackson says the survey will help drive their next steps. The survey is open until October 31st and residents are encouraged to participate. Reporting in Evansville, Courtney Green, 44 News.